Dad. And will you please stop behaving like a child? It's the thin end of the wedge. What is, Dad? You're trying to get rid of me. Now, don't go on, Dad. Yes, I bet you've lit my little room already. And that lay about husband of yours is flogging all my bits and pieces. Don't be silly. <laughs> Tell you one thing, you won't get me post office book because I've got it here in my pocket. Yeah. Nobody's after your pension, yeah. Dad. Pity I wasn't an horse. And you can take me down to the knacker's yard. <laughs> <laughs> Look, all I'm suggesting is that you spend a pleasant evening here at the Darby and Joan Club. Darby and Joan Club. I just want you to get out and meet a few people of your own age, that's all. And pray may I inquire what is wrong with the lads down at the... <laughs> <laughs> they are just a bunch of loud-mouthed, beer-swilling old men who think about nothing but darts and horse racing. That's a fine way to talk about your own father. <laughs> now, look here, Dad. I don't want to get into an argument. Are you going in there or are you not? No, I am not. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Hang I'm on. not. Hello, Miss Possil. Hello, Mrs. Palmer. Welcome, welcome, welcome. <laughs> and who have we here? Uh, this is my father, Mr. Lampwick. Jolly D, another Derby to keep our Jones happy, eh? They'll be lucky. <laughs> <laughs> Twenty years ago, I'd have marked all their cards. <laughs> you now, Dad. Have a nice time. Tata! Yeah. I bet you by the time I get home, they'd have sold it. <laughs> Come along now. Let's take our things off, shall we? Well, I'm game if you are, yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Here we are. Yes. I say, if we're going any further, I think I ought to warn you, I haven't got me comms on. <laughs> <laughs> well, now, the first thing... <laughs> is to find you someone to talk to. Oh, now, yeah. this is Mr. Goodmay. It's his jolly good fun. He'll keep you in fits. He looks as if he's already had one. <laughs> now, you two settle down for a good old chin wag while I pop off and fetch you a cup of tea. I would like a ginger nut. One or two? Only one. The excitement would kill him. <laughs> I race pigeons, you know. Go on. You're the beaten one. <laughs> they um, lay little blue eggs. Lay little blue eggs, do they? What do you expect, licorice all sorts? <laughs> I had one called Susie. If I let her out in here, she would fly off straight down to Portsmouth. Yeah, well, I had a sister like that once. <laughs> It's a, pity, old... uh, it's a pity she didn't lay little blue eggs and all. <laughs> I was an old contemptible. So was I. I was on the Somme. So was I. I spoke to Lord Kitchener. I bet you haven't got an inside lavatory. <laughs> <laughs> Here we are bearing goodies. Biscuits for Mr Goodmays and a nice cup of tea for Mr Lampwick. Yes, well, give it to him. He can dip, dip his gym to knuckle in it. I'm off. Oh, no, 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 no. We can't have that. No, no, no. Uh, look, what? I want to introduce yes, you to I... a very nice lady. Yes, I, I... Now, Mrs Kent, I want you to welcome a new member. It's his very first time here. Come along now, everybody. Enjoy your day. James. James Lampwick. Yes, that's my name. How did you... Oh, blimey. Nellie Plumpton. <laughs> How long has it been? Oh, it must be all of 50 years. Oh, blimey, do you know you haven't changed a bit? Oh, <laughs> you go on with you. You're just the same old Jimmy. Always the, the blarney. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, well. <laughs> Who'd have thought, eh? Only seems like yesterday you and I were walking out together. <laughs> <laughs> Mrs. Kent, she called you. Mm, yes. That's right. But I'm a widow now. Oh, yes. Well, so am I. You know, I'm I'm on my own. Oh. Yes. Here, Here do, do you, you remem remember? 
<laughs> now, you first. Oh, all right. <laughs> I was thinking how my old dad used to go on at you for keeping me out so late. Oh, yes. A proper old charter he was, wasn't he? Mm. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Do you remember? Do you remember when he uh, when he locked you in your bedroom? Oh yes. yes. You were going to take me to the music hall. That's right. You? Yes, yeah. yes. Of course, cool. I had some shows in them days, some oh. wonderful tunes. Mm, <laughs> do you remember that one that went? A she's a my a lady, lady love. <laughs> <laughs> Not like nowadays. Them youngsters with hair all over the place, wriggling and squirming. <laughs> In the old days, I'd have chucked a bucket of cold water over them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. Now, where were we? Your, uh, your dad had locked you in your bedroom. That's right. Well, what did I do? Oh, what did you do? Yes. You pulled up the railings of the front of our house. Oh, that's right, oh, yes. Oh, you was uh, ever so strong in those days, Jimmy. Yes, I was, wasn't I? Oh. Eh? And I remember I propped the railings up against the house like a ladder, and up I went. Yeah. <laughs> and that's when you broke your leg. Yes, some silly idiot had left the gate open. <laughs> <laughs> My mum was ever so upset. Your mum was upset? Oh, oh. yes. Well, bless her. How, how is the old lady? Oh, she passed over years ago, love. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, well, my old dad would be very sorry to hear that. He's not here still, is he? Oh, no, no. Oh, no. No, no. He's in Canada. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, well, it is nice to see you again yes. after all these years, Jimmy. Yes. Yeah, yeah, I tell you what, why don't you come down to the Fox and Duck and have a drink with the lads and me, eh? Oh, I don't think I ought yes, to. Yes, go on. <laughs> I'd like to show you off to the boys, eh? <laughs> now, if I remember rightly, it's a port and lemon. Oh, <laughs> oh Jimmy, <laughs> you could always talk me yes, into anything. Yes, I know. Well, come along then. <laughs> Oi, Birdman, you fancy coming down to the pub for a drink? Oh, no, no. Oh, no, then. Hey, Jeb, we're going down to the pub. Oh, come on, yeah. and bring Amy. Where are you? Oh, this boys and girls, it's time for bingo! Bingo time! Where are they all going? Oh, we're just going to slip down to the local for a quick one, Miss P. Why don't you, uh, loosen your stays and join us? <laughs> Where are the boys? Do you know? Yes? I think that's a jolly good idea! <laughs> <laughs> Yes. You're a very wicked old man. Yes. Well, a couple of weeks here and I'll take years off this lot. 